Hi guys, I'm going to make the video for the how to bind FRSKY DTR second plus telemetry system. So I'll let you know how to guys do it. So with the NXR terminology, I got you basically just put the module inside, and it's very important about these two switches you can see there they should be on the off on the bottom side so i think we'll fit the off is called rppm signal or something god knows so put this on the bottom both are them and then your transmitter supposed to be off see my transmitter is off so what do you do you press this button it's called a HS or HS button so you press this button turn around and turn on your turnology 9XR make sure all the switch on bottom you can start hearing the noise and you can see on the back the red light is flashing so and then you, what you do now that's your transmitter sorry for a little bit noise because I put the, my motor on the side so I'll take the motor off so and remember guys the number one is the throttle I just figure out and so what do you do put this there and put this button press it and supply a power to your receiver now you can take your pin off you can see this red light is blinking so do don't get panic and think is not binding that means is a binding procedure done make sure everything is down now you turn off your transmitter power and now you can disconnect your the receiver power again it's done now you can turn on your transmitter power and now you can put your oops oh I did something wrong is that oh. yep give a couple of seconds have a look I haven't touched anything just wait and patience so see there's a red light binding this my this now I can put the number two is Elron server so you guys see it it's done so I put this in the Elron as number two all good all the channel done for you guys sorted very shortly when I done it now you can see the light there that's my servo and this is my Elron have a look this binding procedure done you can see it nice and clear and I'll show you my motor is also so when I can put throttle just for the testing so yep you guys have a little bit kind of idea so if you any questions anything you guys need to know and hopefully I will I'll sort it out for you guys so again so is a binding has been done so and will be on the back will be the solid light and what you do still see I'll turn my transmitter see as it start blinking and then again turn on my transmitter on how it goes have a look
here we go less than a second here we go all balance up so that's my this and that's my motor is a little far away but you can hear the noise now I can disconnect the power still check with this and then also turn that's the, your normal receiver again what we're going to do the power of the transmitter here we go the mini screen coming 11.9 volt and then we can put this transmitter see how long will take it's less than a second man has done again put the throttle up and that's in your thank you for watching is any anything you guys just uh, let me know thank you for that any question on the bottom thanks